It is with deep humility and heartfelt gratitude that I express my sincere appreciation for all those who have supported me at the launch of my new book in New York. There are those who I know supported me from afar and could not be in New York. I am deeply and grateful for your support and for your kind words. I want to give special thanks to the Consulate General of New York, the staff of the Consulate General and the Consulate General himself, Mr. Andre Laveau, for assisting and coordinating the event and all that they did behind the scenes. I was particularly struck by the lovely prayer and prophetic greeting of Ms. Sharon Leon's Agby, and I deeply thank you for your kind words of prayer. I also wish to thank those who brought greetings and special remarks, Justice Sylvia Hines Radix, the Honorable Deputy Queensborough President Ebony Young, Mr. Carl Forbes Jr. Attorney at Law and President of the Metropolitan Black Bar Association of New York, Dr. Jessica Adams, Public Health Specialist, Mr. William Joseph Jr., former Executive Director of Legal Aid in Maryland, I was struck and I'm sure those who attended would speak about the excellent renditions of Dean Goldston and Miss Carol Addison. I wish to thank both of them, uh, Dean, for your mastery of the pan and those beautiful renditions that showcase our talent of Trinidad and Tobago and I wish to also thank Miss Carol for sharing your gift with us and the beautiful renditions that you contributed. I think both of you added that special magic to already magical moment. I wish to thank Senator Paul Richards who was the master of ceremony and I think no one can do it better than he can for all the support that he has given and what he did at the launch in New York. I know that uh, several persons were, there were lots of friends and family in attendance and well-wishers and there are lots of persons who wanted to be there but couldn't be there but I thank you all for your kindness, for your kind words, for your emails, for your texts and for your general show of love and support. It is overwhelming. I am deeply humbled. And the most I can say is with sincere thanks, I thank you and I thank you all. Blessings, stay safe, always.